profile picture is one of the key things that communicates what your page is about. If you don't have a good profile picture, people are not going to take your page seriously whenever they come across your page. Because when people check your page, the first thing they see is your profile picture before they even see your content. So your profile picture should be able to stand out to be able to capture your prospective audience or your prospective followers. Unless you use your logo as your profile picture in the case of a business page, then you want your profile picture to stand out and be able to attract new audience super fast. And that is what I'm going to be helping you achieve in this video. I'm going to show you how to create an amazing profile picture like this that is going to stand out and actually separate you from the rest. Now, if this is something that you're interested in, let's dive in. So to get started, you have to visit pfpmaker.com, pfpmaker.com. And once you're here, you click on upload photo. So you're going to select the picture that you want to use for the profile picture design. And it can actually be any type of picture and once you select it, it will start generating the profile pics and it's going to give you a lot of variation. Now here it is, it has given us different variation of profile pictures and everything but there's a little customization that we need to do for it to stand out and one interesting thing I love about this is that whatever picture that you upload is going to remove the background of the picture and then you can be able to choose any background that you want, any background whatsoever. So it does it automatically and effortlessly. And guess what? You can use this to make money for yourself. After learning it, you can use it to make money by doing it for people and charging them for it. It could be $5, $10, and you'll be able to generate amazing profile picture for them and they pay you for it. So let me show you how to customize this. So all you have to do is come over here and click on this pen tool to edit. And as you can see, the picture is already out of line, out of the circle. So all you have to do is to just adjust it, adjust it like so, or you can reduce it, scale it down the way you want or scale it up to way you want. I think this is good. I think this is good. Yeah, this is great. And then you click on save and there you have it. Now you have a very good profile picture, well positioned and everything, but that's not all. We're also going to change the color. So whatever your brand color is, you can choose your brand color, whether RGB, whether palette, anyhow you want it, just go ahead and choose your brand color. It's giving me different variations of those colors different design, different variation of the same color, and then you can have amazing, amazing styles. You can come over here and choose if you want shadow, if you don't want shadow and everything. But personally, I don't like shadows. I like it very clean and flat. So that is okay. And you can choose to move between mixed, new, creative, or personal. But that's not all. There's another thing that we need to do to customize the profile picture for it to stand out because like this, it's looking very bland. So we need to touch up the picture and touch up the profile picture for it to stand out very well. And that is what we're going to be doing next. But first, let's select the one that best suits our style. So personally, I like it very, very decent, plain color. It, I think it stands out the most. So all you have to do is to click on download here to download the picture. You have it right now. So now the picture is downloaded. Um, we're going to go over to Canva. Click on create design and click on Instagram post. That's the square Instagram post. That's the best for profile pictures. So here we have it. So we're going to go to upload, upload the picture that we just downloaded. Now we'll go to downloads and put in the picture that we just downloaded now. And the next thing we need to do is to just drag the picture to the timeline and you can see that we have the picture here and drag to the end drag to the end like so, like this, yeah. So we have the pictures here. So the next thing we want to do is to go to edit image and go to see all and then start adjusting the image to give us the exact style that we want. So I'm going to go ahead and adjust the picture like so, increase the saturation a bit, leave the tints, leave this and go over to warmth make it a little bit warm and then clarity yeah like this and then vibrant you need to add a little bit vibrance to make it stand out the more and highlights you try out highlight yeah highlight is good and shadows you reduce the shadows a little bit to darken some areas and there you have it this is perfect now you need to now export this as it is but you don't want it to have this white background. So the next thing you're going to do is to click on share and you're going to go ahead and click on download. And right here, you're going to check on transparent background. And for some reason, I just like sliding this to the end so that it can give me the highest picture resolution 
for my design so i'm going to drag this to the end and then hit on download and it's going to download directly to my drive and i can use it to upload across my social media profile so now it has downloaded let's look at it and see how it looks and here you have it it's amazing looking amazing and quite um, sharp the way i want it so if you use it as a profile picture on your social media page your social media page is going to stand out and the good thing about it is that you're going to be able to use it across all your social media pages just like i did my youtube channel has the same profile picture with my instagram with my twitter with all my social media accounts that way i stand out and anybody can be able to tell oh yes this is seven figure boss right if this video has helped you in any way please smash the like button so that more people can see it and benefit from it just the same way you benefited from it please support me by liking this video and share it to your friends and family so that they can also learn how to have a banging social media profile picture and talking about digital skills i recommend that you watch this video next to learn more ways you can make money online with these digital skills thank you very much for watching and see you on the other side